In this SFX makeup tutorial, you'll be learning how to go and do fake stitches that are on your finger, but these can also be applied to pretty much anywhere that you'd like them, and this is also great for cosplay. So let's get started. We are going to start this SFX makeup off with a quarter size amount of scar wax. I am using Synwax, and usually Synwax gets pretty sticky, so petroleum jelly helps to keep it from really sticking to everything, and I mean sticking to things to the point that you can't work it at all. So this also helps with scar wax as well too. After it's fully and totally prepped and warmed up, roll it out, it should look kind of like a slug pointed at both ends, and then apply it to your thumb. And then start to go and blend the sides in after you have it stuck down. Use petroleum jelly to blend it further, use a circular motion to go and really get this blended in, and what you're going to want to do is make it look like it's pretty much an extension of your finger. After you have the scar wax blended, you're going to go and take a paper towel and remove any extra petroleum jelly just to make sure it doesn't look too oily. After that, go and take a blunt sculpting tool, create a line, dip it into petroleum jelly, and then drag it through the center. The petroleum jelly really does help a lot. From there, go and cut some small pieces of black string. These should go and fit the cut, so keep in mind how big you want these. After that, go and put black cosmetic in the center of the fake cut, follow it up with red and blend this. This should be nice and messy and also go to the outer portions of this, so use a dabbing motion and then put fake blood into the center. After the makeup has fully set, we're going to move on to the pieces of string that you cut. Start off at one end of the fake cut. Use a blunt sculpting tool and push in both ends. This is going to take a little bit of time along with also maneuvering depending on the thickness of the string that you used. I used a pretty thick string. If you're using normal sewing thread, it's going to be a lot easier to go and do. It's just not going to look as realistic. After you have one piece down, go and move on to the next. The ones in the middle are going to be a lot easier to go and maneuver. And as you put these down, it's going to go and draw the scar wax inwards. Now I have five strings that I put down. You can always put down more or less, but I do suggest putting down at least four. But the more you put, the more realistic it's going to look. Then follow up where the holes are in each string with a little bit of red cosmetic. Now onto powder cosmetic. Tap off your brush and lightly brush this with powder cosmetic. Since the scar wax is a wax base, this is going to look really real after you've finished up this makeup. Now again, you can go and pretty much make these cuts look as big or as small as you would like to, and you can also put them anywhere on your body for cosplay. Thank you all so much for watching, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, have a great one and take care.